The constituency of Point Fortin is one of only two constituencies that are bordered on all sides by the sea except one. The eastern boundary begins at the northwestern corner of Perseverance Estate along some existing roads to an imaginary line to the Cap de Ville Forest Reserve and the Aireen Forest Reserve until Carapal Road, then turns south, then southwesterly to the sea coast. What the map cannot show you is how close-knit the communities in this constituency are. Communities like Chatham and Cedrus, Ekakas, Losiro, San Francisco. We spoke to a few of these constituents as they conducted their daily business in the borough of Point Fortin. What we found is that most, if not all, thought that not enough was being done to develop the constituency. Like this man from Cedrus. Four hopes, backward since, since about 30 years, Point Fortin backward. Uh, and and the entire Cedrus. And what, and what, but what you would like to see change in the area? The improvement, the health centre improve. Train care to go to school like private school. Little infants, little infants shouldn't be paying private teachers. Let the government find the same school to have teaching going on in the same school. From and this fellow opted not to go on camera to say his piece. 20 years ago, you have two points, you see the same thing. You come two points again, you see the same thing. Is that no development? And this point 14 businessman agreed that there's a lack of development. He went further to say that enough is not being done for the small businessman in the borough. We hear from sense, I mean small, and going up is the same thing. We have no difference really, nothing really much in point. And according to the mayor, now they're moving away from here to this study. We're trying to hustle by the roadside. They come in, you have to move. We go again somewhere else and they come, you have to move. They have no really spot for nobody to really sell like coconut water, doubles and things. They always want to move you, move you, move you. It's only a little while now they're moving because through a KFC, you know? But otherwise it's just the same thing as everybody else. It has no different change, work, same thing, everything, same thing. The sale kind of hard. I mean, through it, I have no work. And we came upon this lady who worked in the constituency at the Point Fortin Area Hospital. Well, certain places you're seeing improvement and certain places you're not seeing in point. Right now we need the hospital so badly. Things are so bad there. You know, we need workers in the hospital also and a lot of things to be like washing machines and all this stuff, you know, because it's really, it's not nice. It could be better. And these young women of Point Fortin. Well, they renovated the beach down Clifton Hill. But that's what I'm to do with this? Uh-huh. That's, that's, that's all they do. And when it came time to tell us how they're voting and if the current state of the constituency has any impact on who they're voting for, this is what they had to see. Do you vote? Yeah. Do you vote in this yeah. Vote? And you make up your mind who you're voting for already? Well, I think I vote in the UNC. Ah. Yeah, we still have to vote when time comes to vote, but we don't know yet who we vote in. Not yet. We have nobody else yet in mind because we are getting no change still. If we get a little improvement, we're going to know what we're doing. You understand? I'm mean, doing point for here. I sell in coconut over 40 years. You know? And it's the same thing right through with me. Do you vote? No, I, who are voting for? Me not voting for nobody. Again, pay when I vote? People no, I'm not voting nobody again. again. I good. I stop votes. Stacey Ann Providence, C News.